All right, crew. So today I wanted to talk about how I use my ultra wide monitor correctly um, when I'm using Zoom and Teams and so on uh, through essentially Dell Display Manager. So what we're looking at here on the screen is my Dell 4021QW uh, 40 inch ultra wide curved monitor. It's a lot to say all in one go, but um, I wanted to show you how it's changed the way I I position things and orient things inside of, um, well, on, on my computer for the purpose of Zoom and Teams, teaching online and that sort of thing. So it turns out that, t that um, you know, it, tur it turns out that teaching in ultra wide is not all that great because then what happens is your students get bands on the top and bottom of of their view and maybe they don't have an ultra wide monitor so then it shows up weird or maybe they're just running on standard definition so it shows up weird and so on and so forth so the remedy to that is to not share an entire screen but to maybe just share a section of your screen so what i've done is i've made solidworks uh this region my f essentially 4k native and then these two virtual monitors here on the left hand side my you know added sections my bonus sections essentially um, as far as role to sit on the screen now what i typically do is i'll go ahead and put my zoom interface here so i can see like the list of people and uh you know i can put chat down here i can put actually my uh, uh attendees my participants all the views of my participants down on the left hand side or really anything else that i need to snap here so what i've done is i've pre-configured the screen so that everything lines up um I've mapped up SolidWorks for it to be 4K native, and then kind of put these other screens as placeholders in these locations. And what that allows me to do is create a custom uh, uh, sectioning, essentially, of my monitor by using the Dell Display Manager. So if I look at Dell Display Manager, I have these default views over here, but I want to make my own custom one. So for that, you can just open up the Dell Display Manager and then go to uh, Easy Arrange. Select one that's kind of close. In this case, I selected this. Now, this one wasn't wasn't quite 4K in this big square. So um, all I did was drag SolidBricks to a known 4K resolution, which I was able to do with um, Camtasia. It tells me what 4K is. So I dragged it over to the left and to the right until all the spacing was correct. And then I clicked the Create a Custom Lot, a, a Custom Layout. And you click save and then now um, when you go to drag and move things around uh, you know it'll snap to those particular regions of the screen thus making it really easy to share your content so again now when i share um, with obs or if i share with zoom i would not share my entire desktop i just share a portion of the screen and you box select it or in this case in obs um, i would just have to select the scene that's then correlating to the portion of the screen that I'm wanting to share. So this combination really has made me, uh, has helped me to be organized when I'm teaching so that I can see how attentive my students are, um, what they're doing or looking at at the time with their webcams on, right? Um, or if they're talking to someone else on the background. Um, likewise, if I if I have chat open or there's questions or we're watching something, I can put the chat uh, you know open in the same screen, which is the screen that I'm looking at like the majority of the time, uh, so that I don't miss anything, right? Or I don't see a chat or a question from a student and then don't see it for like another five or ten minutes. Like that's what I want to avoid. And and this interface with this sort of setup is just so convenient. And if you're not using it, you're really missing out. Um, even if you don't have an ultra wide monitor, Dell Display Manager still has lots of perks to it. So all in all, using ultra wide with Zoom and Teams and any one of those sorts of sorts of applications is not really a roadblock with an ultra wide monitor. And for this simple reason, right? Now, let's say you don't have a Dell monitor, so maybe you don't have access to the Dell Display Manager. That's okay. There's a bunch of the app. There's a bunch of apps out there, right? One, the other one that I would suggest that I've used personally is the Nvidia uh, Desktop Manager that allows you to split the screen, you know, very similarly. Although I haven't explored the custom options, I'm sure there is some sort of custom options for that. 
So, yep, something to look forward to and, you know, snag that ultra wide when you're ready. So, hey, if you like this video, I can't thank you enough for watching it. Uh, be sure to hit the uh, like and subscribe there. And, you know, we'll see you next time. Right on.